So, Bill, you've been advising uh, young entrepreneurs how to become successful, uh, but I understand that you also you will try to make the same attempt for for companies how to yes. be more uh, entrepreneurial. Yeah. And I understand that you have already some for them. So, what are your key advices for large companies to to be more entrepreneurial? So, first of all, uh, I think that. Big companies can't be afraid of entrepreneurship. They have to actually embrace it. They can't kind of look at it as something that's bad, um, and they have to embrace it for their own or for their own employees. And you know, maybe you'll lose an employee or two, but that's going to be far outweighed by the fact that you'll have employees that are more motivated, more creative. Um, if you do a good job in providing an environment, people will want to stay. But companies need to be more innovative. So, what advice do I give them? Teach them entrepreneurial mindset, skill set. It's okay to be different. It's okay to, to fail if you're learning something, if it was an intelligent. But also, how do you get products to market that customers really want and are willing to pay for? Focus on the customer first, not what you want. Not pushing out what you want. Build what the customer wants and build it back from there. This is the key, this is the key insight that you have to have as an entrepreneur. And often, when I was at IBM for 11 years, I started to get to the point where I think, ah, I know what they want. Because you don't need it as much. You, 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 when you're an entrepreneur, you need to listen to the customer. Sometimes when you're in a, a big company, you start to get comfortable, and you say, I'll tell the customer what they want. And that's easier to do in a big company, but it's not good. Not good for business.